Hey guys, thanks so much for stopping by my channel. I want to share with you a project that I did for a Valentine swap. This is being hosted by Mom and Me Crafts, who is Patty, and Hello, It's Me, Roxy, who is Roxy. They both are on Instagram and on the YT. Instagram is where they put the swap together. They partnered us up with another individual and my partner is Gina and Gina is Scrapanology here on the YT and also on Instagram. So let me share with you the requirements. We had to use Valentine paper. We had to do a loaded mailbox, a memory decks card, a shaker, a Valentine's Day card, one crafter's choice, five die cuts, a gift between $10 and $20. Everything had to be in pretty packaging, and that's it. Um, the paper that I used is Happy Hearts and Sweet Talk, both by Simple Stories. So I, I mostly used um, Happy Hearts, but I also incorporated some Sweet Talk in it as well. So let me just get right into what I created. Um, let me go ahead and start with the cards. I ended up doing two cards. This is the first one. And this is a digital file from My Scrap Chick. This um, embellishment piece on the front was gifted to me by Sam last year, I believe, when we did a Valentine swap. And it went perfectly with this. Very, very nice. And this is the inside. I did line the inside. And I love how that turned out. This is the second card that I did. And this may look familiar to you because the dies that I used on here were from Crazefire. And I did a uh, video using this card and, and these dies, rather. And I love how it turned out. Those dies are so stinking cute. Love it, love it, love it. And this is a piece from the um, paper kit and cut these words out with my Cricut machine. Okay. I did some embellishments as well. This is a set here, which I actually already had for a swap that I did last year, and they just went perfect for this swap. I did have a few left over, so I am sending these off to their new home. And this is... um. I think this is a digital file from Kate's Cuttables, I believe. So cute, love how it turned out. This is another embellishment that I am sending to a new home. I actually also did this a while back as well. And I wanna say that this is KS Crafts die. And what I did was just add some stickers to it. Look at these little um, puppy dogs with the heart sunglasses. So, so cute. So I will be sending this as well. And you already know, you already know, you already know that I have to do a mug. This is also a digital cut file. Um, it might be treasure designs, treasure box designs. I'm not sure, but you know how I feel about my mugs. And I think it is so, so stinking. Cute, absolutely love it. And I love the blue paper, so, so pretty. This is the back of it. So stinking cute with these little heart pieces on here and a little glitter on the top as well. Love it, love it, love it. This is also one of my embellishments that I did. Sorry about that glare. I also, this is another Christ Fire dye that I used did a video on this one as well so you probably have seen it I'm not gonna take it out but yeah you, you probably have seen this if you watched my video okay what else here this is my memory decks card this box here is 
Adriana Alvarez. She, I forgot what she called this box, but it's a Memory Dex hard box, I think. I did not use it as a Memory Dex card. I only wanted to use the box portion to house the Memory Dex card that I did create. But the box is so cute. Let me just show you the box. So, so stinking cute. This is a print and cut that I did, but it's also, um, this is Kate's Cuddles as well. Of course, you can do it as a print and cut, or you can actually cut out the individual pieces to piece them together, but I did a print and cut for this one and just stuck it inside of this envelope. So, so cute. This, uh, all these envelopes here are so cute. Also, Christ Fire as well. Love how it turned out there so stinking cute and this is my memory dex card this beautiful rosette here another um, embellishment gifted to me by sam from a previous swap last year this little puppy dog here these are actually tags that i purchased from hobby lobby way back when still had some in my stash i thought it was perfect this bow here is a clip also from Hobby Lobby, and I use this little, these little beads here, this little um, tag, heart um, tag here. I forgot, this came from um, Target a while back. I've had it in my stash. And look at this, you're sort of cute. Love it, love it, love it. So stinking cute. Okay, let's continue on. I also did a, what do you call this box? Oh my goodness, right on the tip of my tongue. I forgot what you call this, but you see what it is, right? I did this box. Inside of this box, I actually have some of these die cuts. And some of them I even wrapped up in plastic to mimic you actually opening up candy. So I think it turned out so, so cute. Again, these pieces from the paper pads that I used. And this paper, so, so pretty. Love this print. Love the colors. I tied each end with yarn that I had in my stash. Love, love, love how it turned out. So stinking cute cracker box that's what i'm trying to think about cracker box um let's look at this here this is a box a cup that i purchased from hobby lobby years ago i had a few of them left over went perfect with this thing in the inside i put some of these tags for gina I also have my shaker in here. What do you know? Another mug. So, so cute. Love it. And I also included some bows as well. This bow is by Scrap Diva Designs. So, so cute. Love it, love it, love it. I'm just going to put that back in here and continue on. Okay, here we go. I also am including a sequin mix. Love how it turned out. This is a digital file as well. I cannot remember where I got this from. I've had it for so long and I thought it would just be perfect to house this little sequin this little sequin uh, mix. And this is another dye by Scrap Diva 29. Went perfect here absolutely love it so stinking cute okay this here is a matchbox love it love it love it on the front you see that little doggy again so stinking cute puffy stickers from the um paper kit this little camera die not die camera paper clip that's holding the uh matchbook closed and in the inside of this is where I have my die cuts. So I have to adhere that down so it won't come out. 
but love, love, love how this turned out. And you know what? I really, really enjoy making um, making these little matchboxes. So, so cute to house embellishments. Okay, and this is the back. Let me continue on. I have this little box ba um, bag here. Another embellishment from Sam from our swap last year. I also included the um, the tool with the white specks. Absolutely love this tool. And in the inside, I have um, more embellishments. These these embellishments I also included with the Christ Spire. Um, project share as well. I'm not going to take these out. As you see, I already have them stuffed in with the the paper, the shredded paper, so I'm not going to take them out. But check out this box. How stinking cute is this? And I think this box is Laura Whitlock, I want to say. Digital file Laura Whitlock box here. So, so cute. Almost finished. I have another box here. This um this is also a digital file. I can't remember where I got this digital file from. Love the way it turned out. This is a bow that was gifted to me by Solo Crafts, who is Denise. She is Denise um, on the YT as well, Solo Crafts. We did a swap last year, I believe. And I had some of these um I um ice cream cone. This is not an ice cream cone. I had some of these ice cream sundaes left over. I did um, create these for a swap last year. I had some left over, like I said, and this is, this is what is in the inside of this box. Some of these embellishments here. I have a sticker here that says, love you more than chocolate. A little sequin here and there. Again, using the tool with the white specks. So, so cute. Look at that cherry. Really, really pretty. And my last set of embellishments. Oh, oh okay. This is another set of embellishments that I created. I'm trying not to have that glare staring you in the eye. Um, this is the, I want to say KS Craft as well die. The Hershey Kiss die. I've had this die for I've had this die for so long, my first time using it, and I think it turned out so stinking cute. Love it. So, so cute. And let me share with you, oh, how about this here? This is a tag that I um, did as well. These little girls here, another Crayspire die. Did a video on this as well, so this may look familiar to you. I absolutely love the colors. I love the colors of the ribbing. So stinking cute. These puffy stickers here from the paper kit. Love it, love it, love it. It says February and hey there, Valentine. So stinking cute. On the opposite side, it says to open. And this is where I have my little gift here for Gina. So Gina, I hope that you can use this and I hope that you enjoy it. So, so cute. Okay, the last thing I have to share is the mailbox. Now, let me see how I'm going to show you this. This is my mailbox. Look at how pretty this paper is. I absolutely love it. I love the bright colors. This pink and these little pops of orange is just really, really working for me. This is a little piece from, I think this piece here was um, a piece that Sam gave me as part of some as part of an embellishment that she created went perfectly well right here I'm loving that it is highlighting the little um, pieces of orange in the paper I use this here another puffy um, sticker from the paper kit this number 14 is a digital file as well it's an Etsy file that I have had in my stash, cannot remember um, where I purchased it, but yeah, it, it's been in my stash. This is the front 
of the mailbox again using this cute little doggy tag here so so stinking cute using the tool with the white specks again pieces of the um puffy ephemera these cute little hearts and here on the front where i have the mailbox tied closed i'm using that ribbon again the uh, the blue and the pink so so pretty and this is the other side of that mailbox be mine stickers here from the paper kid so so stinking cute this is the back of the mailbox and the bottom look at all the candy so stinking cute and this mailbox is already stuffed i'm not going to take these out to share um, when she does her reveal um hopefully you will see that and you will see what's inside of the box that's all that i have to share thank you patty and roxy for putting this swap together i really enjoyed myself Gina, I hope you like what I created for you. And thank you guys so much for watching. You already know that I appreciate it. You guys have a great crafty day. Until the next video, bye-bye.